Okay, just as a disclaimer before I begin, I would like to say that this video was originally uploaded on June 22nd, but due to some editing mistakes, i.e. the lines being out of order, it's been deleted a few hours after the upload. This is the correct upload to watch, so yeah. Um, thank you for being patient, everyone. Hello everyone, Doodle Tones, the sixth worth channel on YouTube here, with another terrible commentary. In this video, I will be covering someone named Sam Devlaga. So Sam Devlaga is a YouTuber who typically makes discussion videos. To be honest, I'm not a huge fan of his content, mostly because of the use of the Microsoft Sam voice. Now I know I'm a fan of Automagic Critic and he uses the Microsoft Sam voice, but Sam Devlaga used his real voice in the past, and in this video, he'll be using his real voice. Now recently he's been complaining about Jeffy from Super Mario Logan. He's been saying that Logan's been using Jeffy too much and it's getting repetitive. While I can agree Jeffy's a little bit overused, it's not the end of the fucking world. All Logan's trying to do is make money and appeal to his fans. Most of his fans want Jeffy and the fans want is what the fans get. I'm not saying you have to like Jeffy or Super Mario Logan. It's fine to have an opinion, but if you give a shitty reason for having that opinion, Someone's going to call you out for it. So anyway, let's just begin with the video now. Hello people, some of the vlogger here, and what you're seeing on screen is... SMO Movie Bowser Jr. sneaks out, and SMO Movie Jeffy sneaks out. And the reason why I have these two videos on screen is because... Logan once again made a rehash of an older Bowser Jr. video and put Jeffy in the title. For views. Okay, so how is Logan rehashing ideas a bad thing? He changes up the plot from these two videos, and I didn't realize this is even a rehash at first. And it's not just replacing Junior's name with Jeffy. While Junior and Jeffy did both run away to see a movie, Jeffy used a clone to escape, and the clone caused damage. So my point is, while plot A was similar in these two videos, plot B was very different, which caused a different ending. This is getting old. We already had that crap in SMO movie Bowser Jr.'s piggy bank and Jeffy's piggy bank. Bowser Jr. gets body trained and Jeffy gets party trained and etc etc. It's getting old. Again, they're changing up the plot a little bit. And how is it a bad thing that Logan is taking an old idea and applying them in different ways? Yes, it can get a little bit repetitive seeing the same ideas used over and over again. But you never go on in to say that. You just say he's rehashing ideas and you don't claim why that's a problem. You did say it's getting old, but you need to give a little more explanation than just that. And I would recommend not making any more rehashes at this point. Yes, Logan, don't make any rehash ideas. All because Sam DeVlaga says so. In all seriousness though, Logan's been doing these videos for almost 10 years. So there's a good chance he's running out of ideas. So he's taking old ideas and putting a twist on them. Anyway, on with the video. So, in the video, Jeffy, once again, has another swearing rampage. That's right, Jeffy swearing comes back again. Apparently, swearing at Mario is funny nowadays. So these 9 to 12 year old kids that might be using these swear words at their mother, you know. Well, Logan did add in Jeffy getting punished for swearing, which is something we've never seen before. So that's something new. Jeffy! That's it, Jeffy, now you're grounded. For what, bitch? For cussing, Jeffy, we said no more cussing, you won't stop cussing, so now you're grounded, and that's why you can't go to the movies, because you're grounded. Not to mention, once again, we hear the phrase, are you freaking high from Jeffy again? I don't get it. Do you honestly find this funny? Sam, you're going to need to show proof that he said this. Now I know he said this, I watched the video and Jeffy did say the phrase, but it does feel weird that you say something happened and you show no proof despite you thinking it's a big deal. And that's another thing, why is this such a big deal to you? Yes, the same phrase used over and over again can get old, but that doesn't take up much of the video, so what's the issue? Just to use the same phrases over and over again, I mean really. Logan, 
just because you add Jeffy swearing in a video does not automatically make it funny. How many times do we have to tell you that? Well, here's the thing. Like I said multiple times in the past, comedy is subjective. What you find funny, someone else might not find funny, and vice versa. I would recommend toning down Jeffy swearing. It's not funny, nor would it ever be funny. Well, it was funny the first two times, like in Jeffy's homework and Smart Jeffy, but now it's just overused. Alright, and I would also recommend making a video called Jeffy Moves Out. I would recommend that because even if the Jeffy fanboys get triggered at this change, us older fans will have a break from Jeffy. So now you're saying Logan needs to remove Jeffy all because you don't like him? Logan makes these Jeffy videos since they're the most videos that his fans like. And besides, there are occasionally non-Jeffy and non-Junior videos, like Black Yoshi's Scam, for example. Look at how many Jeffy videos he has made. Do you people like Jeffy so much that you have to get sick whenever you see a video without Jeffy? Honestly. Do you have proof that Jeffy's fans get mad when they see a video without Jeffy in it? I did some searching on the comment section of Logan's new video. At the time of writing the script, that would be two tickets. The closest I've found to someone hating on Jeffy is this comment. I wish we had a Jeffy and Mario Father's Day video. See? This person is not mad that it's not a Jeffy video. All he's saying is that he wished it was a video of Jeffy and Mario for Father's Day. That is why I gave this video a 5 out of 10 on my Google Plus post. Because... It has drawing Jeffy messing up the whole house. He pours mayonnaise everywhere. And he throws it around the freaking house. And Lance thinks this is funny at the end as he laughs his butt off at this bullcrap. You know, the topic of wasting food, that isn't cool. Why would you waste mayonnaise for a video? I really don't get this. Again, Sam, comedy is subjective. Lance finds it funny, you don't. End of story. Lance or anyone else is not in the wrong for finding this funny. Like you would not be in the wrong if you found something funny that Lance did it. It's simple as that. You wasted milk in Chef PP the babysitter. And now you're wasting Maydays. All because of drawing Jeffy. Is this really what you want out of Super Mario Logan? It is not Super Jeffy Logan. It is not. It is Super Mario Logan. Alright? Get that through your heads. Mario is still making appearances in the video since he's Jeffy's dad. Just because Logan uses Jeffy a lot, that doesn't mean he needs to change the name of the channel. Also, these super character Logan jokes are really fucking unoriginal. GameCube dude, if you're watching this video, please do us a favor and do not react to SML movie Jeffy Sneaks Out. Just skip it all together. You will not like it. I guarantee that. You know. Yes, GameCube dude, don't react to this video since Sam says it sucks. Seriously, Sam, what does GameCube dude have anything to do with this video? Even though he makes reaction videos to SML videos, I assume at least, I haven't watched his content. So why not just tell GameCube dude not to react to it over a social media post? Instead of just making an entire segment in a rant video about it. Finally, why do you think GameCube dude would hate this video? Does he not like Jeffy? Does he not like rehash ideas? You never explain as to why GameCube dude would hate this video. I might make a video just giving my honest opinion on Super Mario Logan at some point because I think I am starting to lose a little respect for him. Not that I hate him or anything, but, you know. So now you're losing respect for Logan all because he makes videos that appeal to his fans and not to you. Wow. Just fucking wow. Where the hell is your logic? I'm gonna give you an example. I like Linkin Park's old music, but I don't like their new album. Well, save for maybe two songs. 
Do you see me making a video bitching about it? Or me losing respect for them? No, I've actually gained respect for them for moving in a new direction. And it's the same with Logan. He wants to move in a new direction, and you need to respect that. It's as simple as that. Anyway, I'm ending the video here. So my thoughts. This video was not very good, to say the least. You didn't show any proof. You never explained why things were a problem. You're making Logan out to be a greedy asshole who only cares about money. So overall, do everyone a favor and elaborate more on your points. Show evidence. Anyway, that's all for this commentary. See you in the next one.